have an exclusive for you this morning. We're hearing directly now from the former NFL player suing the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Lawrence Tynes claims dirty locker rooms led directly to an infection that ended his career. ABC Action News reporter Adam Weiner has been following the story closely. He is live now from Bucks headquarters with more on the allegations. Adam. We're working today closely with Good Morning America to show you an exclusive interview with Warren Tynes, the former NFL player who says his career was cut short by negligence right here at Bucks headquarters. Tynes was a longtime NFL kicker who joined the Bucks in 2013, but during training camp, he and a couple other players contracted MRSA, a potentially deadly infection. In an interview with Good Morning America, Tynes explains he was unknowingly sharing equipment with other players who also got a staph infection. Tynes ended up requiring multiple surgeries and claims the team intentionally failed to diagnose him or get him proper medical help. It's really hard. Um, you know, you all the work you put into taking care of yourself and the Bucks didn't do their part. They didn't take care of their facility. They could have done the right things by cleaning that facility, taking care of me, not putting me and the other players that have obviously been infected in danger. Tynes also says he is still living in pain, especially when he walks. Now, this is a copy of the lawsuit filed Monday in court. In it, he alleges that he deserves millions of dollars in damages and is also demanding a jury trial. Meanwhile, Bucks spokespersons saying they will simply not comment on the pending litigation. For now, live in Tampa, Adam Weiner, ABC Action News.